Big guy. Damn. Damn. Oh, hey, oh, hey, oh, hey. Welcome back to another video. Before you get started, make sure you like, share, comment, subscribe. All that good stuff if you're new here. If you're not new here and you still come into my videos, we got beef. I'm going to say that until you hit that subscribe button. Because why haven't you hit that subscribe button? I'm chill. I'm cool. We cooling over here. You might as well join the family. You know what I'm saying? But anyways, wait a minute. My mic's not on here. Hold up. I'll be back. There we go. The settings, the mic, all that shit was messed up, but we finally got it together. But I'm going to do a weekend vlog this time. I'm going to try to do a weekend vlog. Let me switch that. I'm going to try to do a weekend vlog. Y'all know me. I kind of struggle with these things, especially when it's more than just one day of filming. But the weekend's already gone. It's already Sunday, but it's Labor Day weekend. So tomorrow we have off. So I am about to hit legs with my boy Matt in chat. So... We're going to start the video off with the workout and then we're going to get into all the extra activities that we have today. I do have to work at some point today, but it ain't nothing but like four hours. So that's easy. We can do that. Get in, get out. And then I might get my hair braided today. I don't know. Or my sister's going to teach me how to maintain this thing because in the last two weeks, I swear my hair has hit some weird growth spurt. So now your boy can't tame his hair like he used to. So we either gonna do that later today and then tomorrow we're just gonna do a bunch of activities since it's labor day or just like some errands and stuff like that or just like a day in a life i don't know i want to go to the park and take some pictures so we're probably gonna do that i don't know what i have planned but i'm gonna try to make this a whole weekend thing so let's get in here before matt bitch at me and chad pulls up because i need to take some pre and wake up i'm already pretty hyped for the workout so all I gotta do is get in there. So I'll see y'all inside. All right, so I usually just drink, like, when I usually work out, I just come in here and grab one of these C-bums, pre-workout things, low-key goaded for like a casual workout. But since it's leg day, your boy is gonna need this thing right here. It's called Final Call. Honestly, it's probably the like hardest hitting pre-workout I had. It has 3,200 milligrams of beta alanine, and that thing hits. Let me tell you, it hits. So we're gonna do like a scoop. I think we're gonna do a scoop. I'm bring it up here. But yeah, I think we're gonna do a scoop just to call it a day. Should do it a scoop and a half. Should I do it? I don't know. We could probably do it. I'll do it. Let's do like a scoop and a quarter. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, so we usually have music playing in the gym, so y'all probably won't hear much unless I put on the mics, which I might do. But otherwise, y'all gonna hear YouTube video music. The kid. Yo, what's good? Hey, how are you, bro? Good, bro. Yeah, I had to get some pre. All right, let's get this workout in. Feel like he's about to throw up, but oh, I can't move too fast. Hold on, 
Oh god, what the fuck? Legs were killed. Legs were killed. We're, about, we're done. I'm about to head home, eat some food, probably lay down a little bit. And then I got to come back here at 2 to work from 2 to 6. So, not a bad shift, but damn! My shit. Oh, shit, I just threw up in my mouth. Hold up. Oh, that was not a good feeling. It tastes so bad. That was just straight pre-workout. Woo! All right, I'm gonna put this down and just blast this AC and drive home because if I keep talking, I'm gonna throw up. So <laughs> I'll tell you when we get home. All right, so we made it home. I feel like it's lagging, but if it's not, okay, cool, whatever. I'm over it. But yeah, so I ended up showering. My body feels clean finally. Changing to get ready to go to work. And then cooking. So I got my meals for the next few days. And then I cleaned a little bit. So we are all good. We are ready to go. Finally go in there. Thank God today is only like a four hour shift. So it won't be too bad. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, I'm about to show y'all kind of what I do at work, I guess. <laughs> if I even do anything today. And then if I do something tonight, I'll also document that. And then we have all day tomorrow. So that would be good also. But uh, yeah, so. I keep in touch, nothing much, just going through life, et cetera, et cetera. I might have a talk down or talk later because I have some things I need to get off my chest, so be tuned for that. Um, but yeah, so I gotta leave in 15 minutes, so I'll see y'all at the gym when we get there. All right, we made it to work. I'm eating my second meal, so we have two cups of rice, or basically two bags of rice. Um, 6.5 ounces of ground beef and then we have barbecue sauce that I'm about to smother this in because I am not eating this plain. So let me get the barbecue sauce. Bro, it's not that high. <laughs> we got the barbecue sauce. And then we just smother this thing. It's really not that much. It looks like a lot, but it's really not that much. So about to eat this and then if anybody shows up sign them up for a membership and if they don't I'm just chilling here for the next three and a half hours so it's a nice little gear you know what I'm saying but yeah so I'm about to eat this and then I'll check back in, in a minute all right so we have 45 minutes until your boy gets to go home but I did not end up eating my food I don't know, after my leg day, I was cashed out. And this is what, this is one thing about me. So like, I, um, oh, I thought he was gonna come up to me. But I hate eating. I know I've said this in most of my videos, but I really do hate eating. So like every time I feel like I have to eat, sometimes I can eat the whole thing. And other times I'll hit like one or two bites. And then I'm like, all right, I'm good. And that's kind of what happened. Like I ate like, probably like a quarter of it and then I was just my stomach's just like bro or like my mouth didn't want to chew it was so weird so like I just ended up drinking like a protein shake and then I'll eat an Uncrustable on the way home and then eat the rest of the meal that I didn't finish and then and then and then and then and then but <laughs> and then eat dinner so hopefully I'll get all my meals in. I need to eat today because it was leg day and I want my legs to grow in order for them to grow. I need to eat on the days that I trained them. So yeah, that's kind of what's going through my head right now. But yeah, I've been sitting here scrolling through content for the last two and a half hours. But you know, we're almost done. I just need to make my rounds to like clean and pick up trash and stuff like that and then we can head on home. I gotta see if I'm doing my hair tonight. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if I want my sister to braid it or twist it, or do I just wear out the fro for a little bit, but I feel like the fro looks a little funky and I don't like it. Like I like it in the moment, like when it's wet, it's really good, and then when it dries and then puffs out, I'm just like, bruh. But my sister said I'm doing it wrong, so she might show me tonight. Um, but we'll see, I'll update y'all once we get to that point. 
I don't think I ever showed y'all the gym. So you walk in, you come in here, come in, and you have the gym. Quick scan because it's copyright. So, so back here we have the posing room. This is where you see the boy. All his pictures on Instagram are probably from back here. We have the whole gym, biceps, chest, shoulders, back, all that good stuff. My boy Drew right here. Dumbbells. What do you want we trying to do here? Hold up. Nothing. I'm just I'm just showing in the gym. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you bro. And then all the leg equipment is over there. So yeah, pretty big ass gym. So dang, why am I so dark? But yeah, we made it back. Why am I so dark? Lord. So we made it back and I'm in my friend's car because he left his car at my apartment while he was going to on a trip and I took him to the airport etc etc that probably made no sense but anyways you can only park at my apartment complex for like three days in the visitor spot so this is the third day so I'm on my way to take his car to my sister's house but this is this made me realize I do not load like low to the ground cars like it's just not my thing i'm a suv type of guy put me in the sky you know what i'm saying like i like to sit up high you know and be able to look and see down the road like, i feel like in here i'm like trapped to like one point of view you know what i'm saying like it's not it's not given and it's just i don't know it's, i don't like it and it don't <laughs> it drives like a car my jeep drives like a truck that what i'm told and also how i feel but I don't know, I'm into like the SUVs, like give me a range or like give me a forerunner or something like easy. I can drive those easy, but every since every time I get into a car and drive a car, like an actual sedan, I can't do it. And this has nothing to do with like bro's car. Like bro's car is nice, but like it's just it's so low and I have to be cautious of like what I'm running over, like in my Jeep, I can just, you know go straight over stuff and here I cannot do that so yeah that's the thing but yeah we on the way to my sister's house because I lasted two days I am getting my hair done <laughs> I just can't personally can't take uh oh shit is it this is it this is that how you work it yeah that's how you work it but I don't know I don't like my hair right now like i like it but at the same time it's hard to maintain because it has been through turn 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 fuck bro god dang people cannot drive here and it pisses me off but um dang what was i saying oh i don't i like my hair but i don't like my hair so we are about to get it i think braided again braid it down just because like it's just easier with the maintenance uh, my hair is getting longer so it's harder to tame I feel like and like my curls just go all willy-nilly so I think it's just better for me to just braid it especially with me having a corporate job I just don't feel like going in there and like be in front of clients like playing with my hair or like having to worry about my hair like when it's in braids it's all good like that's that's how it is there's nothing to change etc etc and I don't like how this car is making me look so dark <laughs> like y'all cannot see me i cannot see out his back window lord all right let me get out this car i'm i'm, I'm pulling over my sister's crib now so let me get out this car and then oh see <laughs> and then i would talk to y'all when we get inside all right so we made it it's about time to get the hair done i had a wake-up call before i left work like i was um I was about to leave and some two dudes walk in and they saw my camera on like the thing and one of the guys was like, oh, that's your camera. And I was like, yeah. And he was like, oh, so you do content? I was like, yeah. Uh, and he was like, what do you post on? I was like, it started on TikTok and now I switched over to YouTube and Instagram. And he was like, that's where it's at. And I was like, yeah, I'm almost at that milestone. You know what I'm saying? And not knowing like, like that, right? Like they're like that. And I'm like, oh yeah, he was like, oh yeah, like, is it doing pretty well? And I was like, yeah, like I started six months ago pretty much and I'm already at like 1.2. I didn't say K, he was like, mil? I was like, no, K, like, no offense, but I wouldn't be working here if I was at 1.2 mil. Um, but yeah, so, and I was like, oh yeah, like he looked familiar. I realized I like seen him before and so did the other guy. 
and I finally like get their Instagram and stuff like that. And yeah, I'm they're on a whole different level, and you just wouldn't know. Are like content creators, or they yeah, rich? they're content creators, oh. and like the one bro who I was talking to the most, he was like he has like 230k on Instagram, and then went to his uh, YouTube, same thing, with like maybe even more on YouTube, and like all his YouTube videos like have like over 300k views and stuff like that and I was like oh bro like you're big balling you know what I'm saying like I don't know at first I was like I didn't even know and it just seemed like I don't know I almost embarrassed myself <laughs> but no it was cool they were cool and I was just getting some advice on like what should be my next camera etc cetera, etc cetera. and then stuff like that it was a cool interaction though It just, it, it wasn't like a wake up call, but it motivated me even more. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I'm just like, I'm right there. So like, how do I get there? He was like, yeah, bro. And he was like, and I was like, yeah, I have more of a following on TikTok. I just hate posting on there. I just want to switch over. And he was like, how many you have on there? And I'm like, oh, almost 30, you know, uh, almost 30K. And he was like, oh, cool. He was like, yeah, that's like kind of how I started. Like, I took like six months for me to grow to 30k and then like once I hit there I hit like over a hundred within like a month and he was like so if you just keep pushing on there like you know things can turn over and I was like yeah but like I just gotta plan out I guess that content and like be able to post I don't know it's just I don't know it's a lot I don't know what to do like I know what to do it's just like yeah <laughs> But like I know if I put more into it, I can get there, a, like I can gain more, you know? Yeah. That's true, you can probably gain more faster, but yeah. slow and steady win the race. Right. And I'm trying not to like overbear myself or overwhelm myself. Exactly. Because like I even text Ian today, because I don't know it's like we switch the podcast to like every other week but like at the same time I feel like with my work schedule me trying to grow my own brand and you know like I don't know I just feel like and especially with me editing everything and you know having to post everything for like that in the podcast it just seems like a lot for me i don't know we'll see we'll see okay. moment of truth my battery's about to die hey. okay peer died <laughs> get your food Keep stepping in his food. I like it. Now I don't have to do my hair. I said I don't have to do my hair. <coughs> yeah, so she gotta take me home, so I'll see you at the hut. Alright, so it is the next day. I laid in bed until like literally 11 o'clock, so I haven't been doing anything, but right now I am trying to eat my meal before I have to go to the gym. I have to be at the gym at 2. It is currently 1. Y'all can't see that. Uh, it's currently 109. I got to be there at 2, which means I have to leave here in at least 40 minutes, maybe 30, 35. So... I'm trying. I can't eat, bro. I've been, <sighs> been kind of in my head because I am somewhat kind of losing weight, which is kind of crazy because I've been hitting, hitting all my calories and all my food, et cetera, et cetera. And basically, I don't know. I've been losing crazy weight. Like three weeks ago, I lost like five plus pounds and then I took the last few weeks to gain that back and then I'm kind of sitting 
at the at like one weight now and it's not the weight that i want to be at it's the weight i've been stuck at and i'm trying to go like at least 10 or 15 pounds but i don't know what my body's doing my body's like regulating or whatever losing it and i feel like this is gonna happen like it's gonna lose and then some sometime in the next like at some point, like two weeks from now, a month and now, my body's just going to like shoot up like 10 pounds. It's like weird. It happened when I was only at like 140 when I first started. Like I was at 140 for like three check-ins. And then all of a sudden I jumped up to like 155, like in one check-in. It was, it was weird. Like, I don't know. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe it's me. Maybe it's the food I'm eating. But I've been eating the same thing for the last six months. So I don't know. I don't know. So... We're here trying to figure that out, trying to scuff down this meal. We are watching some YouTube. I'm watching currently Christian or Swole Ricketts. His recovery day, which I probably need to do too because I have not done a recovery or like a massage, a deep tissue massage since I started this. And my coach has advised me months ago to get one, but I haven't had the time or the funds to do that because I don't know. For me, ninety dollars for an hour of work when you know your body needs more than an hour of work just doesn't seem right to me. But maybe, maybe in the future. But yeah, that's what we got. So we're about to eat this meal, head to the gym, hit a back day. That one might be more like a mic'd up, like quick little mic up video because I showed y'all the chest. Oh shit, not chest. Leg day, leg snippets from yesterday. And then after the gym, probably go out to eat or like go to like a sushi bar or something. I really want sushi. I've been craving sushi. So we would probably do that. And then um, I want to say I want to go to the park, <laughs> but we'll see. Maybe Ashley will go with me, but I really do want to go to the park. So go to the park, flick up, just chill, talk. I don't know. I need to get back on my day, uh, weekly activities so I can show y'all more stuff that I do because I do do stuff. I just haven't been taking my camera. But yeah, so we got that and I'll check back in on the way to the gym or at the gym, whatever I do. Anyways, we made it to the gym. Let's get into the braids real quick. I don't think I showed y'all really last night, so. I mean, she kind of did her thing, thing uh, kind of did her thing again. And like I said, I really don't, like I like my hair, but like I feel like a different person when I have it in braids. So that's what we did. We put them back in braids. <laughs> so we're really gonna get this workout. I'm low key tired. Like I'm not even gonna cap to y'all. I'm tired as fuck right now, but. You know, this is what we gotta do. This is what we gotta do. Oh shit, y'all can't see me. What is it on my camera recently? I gotta change the settings, but yeah, this is what we gotta do. This is what we gotta do. Finally made it to the gym, but your boy forgot his tripod. So we just gonna do kind of like a mic up, kind of chopped up back day. Chaz on here now. You know what I'm saying? It's not gonna be too bad. We'll get a couple of views and then post it and call it today. Hopefully it doesn't rain after here because I'm trying to do some stuff, but if it rains, this is it. So yeah. Shit, okay, that's a lot more weight than I thought. <laughs> Thank you. 
you cool with just two sets? Yeah, that's fine. All right, because it's already five o'clock. I'm trying to get up out of here. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody would be at the park for me. I doubt it, but hey, hey, we never know. You know what I'm saying? But nah, we about to get there and then I'll show y'all around once we get to the destination. <laughs> so I beat the time, but I've been sitting at this light for I don't know how long. <laughs> like I've been sitting here for like three minutes. You know what I'm saying? I would have been there at 6.40. But now I gotta wait here until this turn signal goes green and then I can finally be there. Look, it's already 6.45, but it's cool. It's cool, I'm cool, we're good. You know what I'm saying? It's about to turn green. There we go, it's green. And we about to swerve on in here. I just gotta find a parking spot. Like, do I park at this hotel or do I park at the other side? I don't know where to park. It looks nice though. Oh, it's a nice little area, not gonna lie. Shit. Oh, that was a stop sign. <laughs> Lord. Anyways. Anyways, I see a parking spot right there. Oh, I just passed one. All right, hold up. I'm gonna park real quick. <laughs> There's stupid kids around, but I pull up and this guy's like, yelling not yelling at this little girl but he's trying to get her attention he's like do you know where your parents are da, da, da. so some kid is lost anyways that's none of my business i ain't got no kids so yeah but this this area is nice though hey 
Like my sister used to live in this area like a couple years ago, maybe like two years ago. And there was none of this around. Like they got restaurants over there, um, like hawkers, flower, flower child, all that good stuff. And then there's a new housing building going up right there. New housing right there. I don't know. This is different. But how do I get over there? <laughs> the park's over there. And I'm trying to get over there, but I don't know how to get over there. So we're going to see. I feel like I'm going the wrong way completely. Yeah, because that's locked up. All right, we got to go this way then. It said 7, but I don't think the park closes at 7. There's just no way. There's an amphitheater over there. This looks nice. They probably have some like live music going on. I might, hey, this might be the new location for you, boy. I'm lying because it's 10 minutes out. It's 10 minutes from my place, which means I'm gonna be like 30 minutes from work. And I just don't like that. That don't set up well for me. So we're not gonna do that to ourselves. That means I have to leave earlier and wake up earlier. And your boy's just not doing that. I'm already 15 away. And that's a good amount of good amount of time to like brief myself to get to work before I have to get to work, you know what I'm saying? Like, if I was too close, I'd be like, dang, I'm too close. And then if I was too far, I'd be like, damn, I don't want to go to the office. So, I feel like 15 is a good, a good distance. Here's the park setup. So, like, you can walk. It looks like it's part of the hotel. Is that a hotel? But, like, it's like a creek. Some trees. We love the nature. And then over there, if y'all can see, I don't know. Uh, there's, like, slides and stuff where the kids are playing. Some hills. The grass looked fake though. And then you got this trail that leads to this long ass bridge <laughs> that goes to the other side. Other side. Oh, there's a rock climbing wall. I probably go away from the kids, you know. <laughs> I don't really want to get them in my video, and I also don't want to like have to be cautious with the camera and stuff. Plus, I just don't want to be around a lot of kids. Like, I don't got nothing against no kids, but like. Uh-uh. <laughs> I understand now. Like, my sister get, used to get real annoyed with me because, like, we're eight years apart. And I was like, dang, she must thought I was, like, a kid. Like, I get it now. I was annoying the fuck out of her. <laughs> yeah, here it is. Scanning it a little bit. And is there even more on this side? So you have more trees. And then there's, like, more green seating area over here with, like, a fountain you can look at. And I'm about to get these stairs because I had this camera with me. It's okay though. I'm gonna try to find a seat and then we can just sit down and talk. Here is the water fountain. Which is nice. In the shade. It's kind of cool over here. Um, and then, let's see. Down here. How do I get down here? I'm gonna just go down the rocks, honestly. Fuck it. I ain't walking all the way around there. Hey, hey. And you come down here, and you got rest of nature. Honestly, I'm gonna just sit down here and just immerse in the nature. I would sit over there where the water is, but seems like a lot of people, and I don't feel like socializing. But, oh, this is better. But yeah, and I realized we gained a lot of new subscribers, a lot of new family. So, y'all let me know where y'all from. I know I'm based out of Charlotte, so I talk about stuff in Charlotte a lot. But, I feel like a lot of y'all are from all over the place. So, I remember I had a couple people from like Nigeria or something, which is cool. But I just want to know. I just want to know where, where the supporters are. I might pull up. That might be a thing in the future. We might pull up and see what's popping, what's going on. But yeah, so uh, I kind of just want to sit here and enjoy nature real quick. It feels nice. There's a nice breeze coming. I probably look hunchbacked AF. But yeah, Labor Day weekend's been chill though. Like we, we, what do we do? <laughs> Friday we worked from home which is cool and then we got to sleep we caught up on a lot of sleep this weekend um, 
Saturday. We just gymmed and worked, then came home, got our braids done. No, that was yesterday. Saturday, we just came home and slept. I think that's all I did. Oh, no, I went somewhere. Not, not saying where I went. But then Sunday, came back, uh, worked out, then worked, and then got my hair done. And then today, laid in bed this all morning, ate. Went to the gym and now we're here. It was a good weekend. That's a good weekend for your boy. Like that's chill. Nothing too outrageous happened. It was just chill. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. But let me let me say this. Like I really don't want to talk about this, but I kind of want to say it. Okay, if you like somebody, right? Would you do the effort to go travel to see that person? That's all I'm gonna say. Would you do? Would you put in the effort to go travel to see that person, especially if you know that person work on the weekends? You would try to flip around your schedule to like go see that person, right? If you really like them, if you really like them, I'm just saying. Would y'all? I just uh, that's all I got. That's all I'm gonna say about the situation, because that also happened this weekend. Some playing in my face, but it's okay. It's fine. We're all good. We're chilling, you know what I'm saying? We're just gonna focus on getting this money, getting this job right, getting this YouTube up, and just being the successful businessman, you know what I'm saying? I'm really liking this pavilion. Hold on. <laughs> the architect in me is, is taking over. Hold on, let me change the ISO back. But this pavilion is like curved, but it's wood. But it's not it's not curved because it's just using straight planks, plank wood planks on it. Y'all can't really see it, but it's just using straight wood planks on like curved uh curved um structure. Which is nice. It's just uses a nice touch, it's not plain. I don't know. Architect me just took over. But yeah. This is nice. I might walk around a little bit. Now, maybe a little bit more. Oh my god, is that a thumbnail? That's what I keep forgetting to do on these thumbnail things. But yeah, that's a thumbnail. Hold up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we actually trying to do the thing. It's a lot of kids around. I should definitely bring Pablo here one day. He have a ball, but the grass is fake, so I don't know. And I don't even know if dogs are allowed. I haven't seen one dog, so we'll see. But I might chill here for a second, and then I might walk over to the other side where the amphitheater is, where the waterfall is, and then get a snippet of that so y'all can see it. And then we're going to head home, and I need to do that before my battery dies. My battery is on 13%, so yeah. I'll see y'all in a second. Sorry for the bad the bad quality right now but uh, let's redo the thumbnail let's redo the thumbnail okay yep <laughs> wait to be honest there's a flower child right here, so I might go in there and get some food, honestly, and then go home because I really don't feel like eating what I got today. And my body reacts to food weirdly, so I get to cheat, I have cheat meals all the time. So I'm about to make a poor financial decision, except for eating the food I have at home, I'm going to spend $20. $20 plus on some food for dinner. But you know, fuck it, we ball. <laughs> so I'm about to get that and then, yeah, drive home. So I'll see y'all when we get back to the cribbo. I don't know why I keep saying I'm going to see y'all at the cribbo, but I'm going to show y'all flower child. So we have is, it's basically healthy food. So you can get like small plates drinks, salads, bowls, entrees, wraps. I usually get the salmon entree with 
either mashed potatoes and broccoli or um, whoa mashed potatoes and broccoli or mac and cheese and broccoli but I think I'm gonna do the ma mashed potatoes and broccoli today so yeah just wanted to show y'all that <laughs> bag is secured but yes this is the place there's just like a bunch of restaurants here it's crazy like this wasn't here like a few years ago so it's just blowing my mind how fast things can, things can just pop up but Yep, bag secured, twenty-five dollars later. <laughs> but yeah, so now I will finally see y'all at home. <laughs> Look at the sun. Oh, this is so nice out here today. I can't, I can't help it. Um, where the moon at? Cause I know this tonight the moon gonna go crazy. I'm a moon guy, if y'all didn't know. But anyways, yes, now I'll see y'all at home. <laughs> I am indeed at home. I did not forget about y'all. It has been days, but I'm not forgetting about y'all. I just, my camera's just been dead for the past couple of days and I just got done editing this video. So we basically ended off here. It was a good Labor Day and y'all should subscribe to my channel. You feel me? But no, if you're still here and new here, make sure you like, share, comment, subscribe, share with a friend, share with your mama, pappy, grandpappy. Um, your aunt, your nephew, your niece, whatever you got that's related to you or your friends, you know what I'm saying? Your bestie and stuff like that, you know what I'm saying? Share with them. But if you're not new here and still come to my videos, like I said at the beginning of the video, we got beef because why haven't you hit that subscribe button? If you have watched more than one video of mine, you might as well subscribe. But I mean, y'all do you, you know what I'm saying? Y'all can miss out on this greatness. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. But <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to close it out here. So I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye.